guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing a monthly spread and this is just a look back at my last one. This was for January. It was from Caress Press and I, ra wow, words. I really loved the clip art on this and how like neutral it was, I guess, because it had like the beiges and the blacks and then just like gold accents. So I really enjoyed it. I do love Caress Press monthly kits. So when she opens up, I'm probably going to get another one from her. So I'll definitely be on the lookout for that, but let's move on over to February here. I'm using the Vintage Valentine uh, Clip Art Kit from Shop Jessica Hearts. This is in her glossy sticker paper, so I'm a little bit scared. I did some pre-planning on the sidebar though, so let's hope it all goes well. Um, But let's take a look here. Okay, so this goes at the bottom and this goes up here which should make it easier to line up, right? Right, that's what I'm thinking. Is there, I'm like so not comfortable with like monthly kits yet, it's kind of rid ridiculous. But I think we'll just use one of these to cover out the flag, or I might not even cover it up because it's just gonna be like a little sliver of pink and like this kit has pink in it, so it'll be fine. Um. So let's line this up like so and stick it down. I don't know. I'm The verdict is still out on how I feel about that. Um, but let's go to this side. Do I have anything? I don't have any, anything happening over here. So putting down that side is going to be interesting. Yikes. Well, let's put this down first because we can do this. Um, I'm trying to think, there's not really any events that I know of right now that I would want to put, like, boxes on. So I might even wait on those. The only bummer thing is, is that, like, to take anything up off of this paper with glossy stickers, I'm gonna have to use undo, but I should probably use undo regardless as I say that and not use it. <laughs> I'm crazy. Okie dokie. Let's do this maybe why is this not lining up it's either like on the line or too far over okay cool that's done i think and then let's see if we can do this sidebar without having to um put down the top let's see if we can do this so we'll put this in here I should line this up with something though. Can I line it up with this line? Yeah, that would be good. Watch it be like too short now. Oh, this was a bad decision, I feel like. Well, we have undo and we'll figure it out. It's fun. Okay, so we'll do these. And then we'll do these. And hopefully... It all lines up. Oh my gosh, it makes a picture. I didn't even realize that. <laughs> That's funny. I like actually didn't realize that. Okay, so does this work? <gasps> I think it worked. Oh no, it didn't. It didn't. My plan has been foiled. I should have just put the top down. Oh well, okay. Well, now I get to take all of this up, which is great, but I mean, I guess you live and you learn. I just did my rewind spread, and I used a tassel planner kit. That video should be up by now, um, so if you guys haven't seen that, you're, you're definitely missing out. No, I'm kidding, <laughs> um, but you should go see it. Um, but the sidebar in that kit was, like, one big sticker piece, and I like threw it down on the paper and it was perfect so I think I was a little bit a little bit full of myself on this one okay but you know what like no we're gonna we're gonna do this we can do this this is this is fine we're gonna do this I'm not putting the top down first because it will be crooked and all over the place so as if this isn't crooked and all over the place at least there's undo on the page already <laughs> 
Uh, what was I saying? Oh, I like threw down the sidebar sticker and it was like perfect and everything like lined up and it was great. So I think I was expecting that to happen this time and it obviously didn't. And I should have known that it wasn't going to happen because lightning doesn't strike twice as they say. Um, isn't that a saying? I don't know. Okay, so there's that. That should be better. It is straight, so at least we have that going for us. And then we'll put this down, and hopefully it works. Yeah. Perfect. Yay. Okay. So let's do some of the, like, trillions of <laughs> holidays that we have going on. Oh, wait. That's right. Her kids have the, like, canceled rescheduled things. So technically I wouldn't have to, like, move a whole lot of stuff. I could just use one of those, but still. I'm going to be cautious. So let's put in Groundhog Day, which really has nothing to do with me because I live in California and like, what is winter? <laughs> um, and then we have Chinese New Year, Year of the Dog, which is very exciting. What year are you, guys? I'm a rat, which I've always hated. Which I'm like, <laughs> I don't know. Especially as a kid, I was just like, I didn't really understand the whole meaning behind it. And like, it's a Zodiac and they all have, you know, they're different features and like none of them are really bad, you know, but I wanted to be something cool. Like I wanted to be the dragon or the dog or something. I don't know, something exciting. Also, am I just like unaware because I don't celebrate Ash Wednesday, but is it weird that Valentine's Day is the same day as Ash Wednesday? I don't know. I feel like that's really weird. And then I also feel like it's really weird that Easter is on April 1st. Am I the only one that finds this strange? Or is this, like, strange for a lot of people? Because I'm a little bit stressed about that because that's that's a lot to take in. Anyways, <laughs> so there's that for the 14th. Hopefully I don't do anything on the 14th because there's no way to mark it. Oh, well. Well, but still, hopefully I do something on the 14th because that would be sad if I didn't. But anyways, what was I saying? I don't even know, know that I was saying anything. Oh, I was talking about Chinese New Year. So yeah, I always wanted to be something cool and not a rat. <laughs> it was felt weird being like, oh, I'm your the rat. <laughs> so there's that. Um, okay, so the first we have Planner Press and Owl Crate Do. Are these like not meant to fit here? Well, maybe we'll do that. And then Groundhog Day. Oh, I should put in paydays too. Okay, let's do that. There's only four, so we'll go dark, dark, light, light. She gives you a lot of paydays, which is really nice if you have like multiple jobs or multiple sources of income or if you want to like track someone else's paydays in your planner, you can. Um, so we'll put these in. Here, get paid on Fridays. Ooh, not that color. This color. And then, let's see. Okay, that's done. Back on track. Now we'll do this blue bill do over here. And then, um, on the fourth, I'm kind of going day by day because. I'm, like, very distracted right now. <laughs> um, on the 4th, we'll do... I really love this, like, red color. Um, actually, you know what? I'm gonna do this blue. We'll just, like, mix everything up. So, we'll do this blue because we're going to my grandma's house. Um, for like a lunch for my godfather. So that's that. And then it's also the Super Bowl this day. So I'm going to use this burgundy. Wait, no. Oh no, don't stick. Okay. <laughs> Wait, I was going to use an exclamation point, but that's not going to work. Um, what could I use that's red? I'll just use an asterisk because why not? So we'll do this with an asterisk for the Super Bowl. And then nothing, nothing, nothing all the way until the 11th, which is 
build due day. <laughs> um, I have scribble prints and um, SPC due, so we'll put that in. Did anyone else hear C do when I said SPC do? <laughs> oh man. Um, okay, and then on the 14th is it is Obsidia. Obsidia's birthday? It's one of your guys' dogs. And I remember because I was talking about how I celebrate my dog's birthday and then I was asking you guys what day your birthday's on. So we have a doggy birthday and that's pretty exciting. So happy birthday to your dog. And we'll put that in with a little paw print sticker because I mean how else would you mark that? So we'll do that. I have a feeling we're not going to celebrate on Wednesday, Valentine's Day because it's in the middle of the week. So I'm not too worried about that. Anywho, moving on to Friday. It is Alea's birthday, my friend Kira's kid. Um, and for that, we will do a blue label type of situation here. And put that in and then on this day, it is one of my pen pals' birthdays, Jenny's birthday. I don't know if she watches my channel or not. I told some of my pen pals that I have a YouTube channel, um, and then some of them I didn't because it, like, never came up. And I'm totally not one of those people that's like, oh, hey, by the way, I have a channel. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, but happy birthday, Jenny, if you're watching. I need to write her a letter. Okay, and then President's Day, nothing, nothing, nothing. And then on the 25th, there is GP Sticker Studio due. And then that will be it for this month. It feels so weird because I don't have a ton of plans this month. Um, and last month, I feel like I had a lot of stuff to put in. Granted, it didn't happen, but I felt like there was a ton of stuff for me to mark, so... Yeah, it feels a little bit strange. But anyways, I'm going to hold on to these two full boxes. They're really pretty, but they're, like, whited out. So, I don't want to put them on the wrong day. So, yeah. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and fill everything out. Probably with this red Sharpie pen, because that's what I used for my notes page kit. And I think it looks really pretty. So, I'm going to do that, put in the date dots, and then I'll be back to show you guys the final result. All right, guys, here is everything filled out, and I did decide that this was bugging me, so I just covered up with one of those little strips that was in the kit. But this is how it looks all filled out. I think, I don't think I cut this straight. Yikes. I didn't even, like, look. <laughs> I was just cutting my little heart away. All right, that's a little bit better. Anyways, so... Here's what it looks like. I totally lost my train of thought. Um, I used this Sharpie pen, like I said. I filled out what I could in the sidebar. It is a different order than I normally put it, but it's because I wanted to, like, scramble up the colors. So, I usually mark, like, my stats for the month down at the bottom next to next month, and then put my, like, what I'm expecting to receive that month up there. Uh, so, that happened. Uh, but other than that, I'm really excited about how it looks. I love all this clip art, or the, the photos. I think it looks so good. Um, but yeah, so this is my February spread. I, I don't know why it's hard for me to speak today. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below if you haven't already. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.